Hey right, man, say man, what's good YouTube? Y'all know who it is, man. It's fortunate. Y'all see y'all see this truck right here? Let me tell y'all what happened. So I went to the movies yesterday to see um uh Maverick. What's the name of that movie? Uh, the jet movie. Anyway, so I pulled up in the parking lot and I see my truck start smoking, like it just started smoking. So I ain't think nothing of it. At first, I, at first, I didn't know it was mine until I got out. And I looked, and I seen some green stuff leaking. So I called my partner, you know what I'm saying? He got diesel, been having diesel. I said, hey, man, it don't look like oil, bro. It's like some type of cooling antifreeze. So he said, nah, bro, that might not be what's called kind of oodle oo. Making long story short. So I drove my truck from Dallas uh, to Perth. So uh, I called him and told him what was going on. He just told me to make sure I got water in it. It should be good to go. So, find out if it's a hose. I'm a, man, I, I don't want to talk about it, bro. I don't want to tell y'all the price. I don't want to tell y'all the price. So, I'm about to hear what he got to say real quick. What we looking like, champ? I didn't see what I expected to see uh -huh. down there, but looking at video, that looks like where it's leaking. Uh -huh. I can put I can put some in it and check it for a leak. Okay. And see what that does, and I'll suck that back out. Please. All right, could I like to say? That's who you talked to this morning. Yeah, that's who I talked to this morning. Then. Like I say, um, I stay in Dallas, but my mom and I stay down here. So like I say, uh, if I need to leave the truck, I leave the truck. If it is that problem, you know, y'all can call me and let me know what's going on before we start actually fixing it. Yeah, yeah, you know what I'm saying? So she, she gets pretty good on estimates. Okay. Okay. Hey, Dave. So, yeah, man. It was leaking. Like, yeah, I see that. How greasy it is right there. It was leaking right there. So it was actually coming from that filter right there. But. When you got these diesels, man, it's like so. So I'm about to show y'all a little quick video. Is the air conditioning not working? No, it ain't getting cold at all. So we thinking. So what you? So what we think it is again? The vap evaporator. Like the, the unit inside your house. Uh -huh. No, you got your outside unit. Uh -huh. That would be what, what this is. Okay. And then the inside unit with okay. the fan that blows okay. it through. It's the All same right. thing. It, it, you know, it's, it's the same. Yeah, for sure. So he told me to make sure I had water in it before I drove it down here. Stuff like that. Huh? I didn't think the vapor was bad when you say it's leaking. I don't see no sign of any green anywhere. Nah, it was just leaking from right there, and it, it's like it did it for like two minutes, and it stopped. Straight up off the shop, babe. Like one of them hoses busted up there. Yeah, right, right, right through there is where it looks like it. So, he told me he don't think it's the evaporator now. But if it is, it is a 10 to 12 hour job, bro. They got to pull the whole dash out. So, it's going to be a couple thousand. 150 an hour times 12. You do the math. Plus the, you know what I'm saying, how, how much it costs to get the part. And y'all know what's crazy? My AC went out on my other car. I'm in Paris to pick that up. My blower went out. Bitches. But y'all know me. I don't do no complaining. It is a blessing that I'm able to have the money to get it fixed right then. I ain't got to wait, you know? So, yeah, man, we're gonna see. Line. 
Oh, okay. We have to might have to order it. I mean, like I said, that's fine if I need to leave it. Yeah. Yeah. So um, I'm gonna leave the truck here, man. And uh, I was gonna have my mom come get me, but I'm gonna just walk over there because it's like really like right down the street. But yeah, man. Um, uh, like I was saying, uh, my R went out in my other car. Then I just had this problem with the truck. Soon I pulled up to the movies, bro. My stuff started smoking just a little bit, but it didn't last long. So then uh, after I left the movies, turn the AC, and that shit was not coming on. So like, ah. Oh. But with me, bro, I never complain about anything. Nothing, bro. I have always been able to take the good with the bad. I just hate the sound of a V6 car. But yeah, man, oh, I had to drive it. I had to drive this thing down here to Dallas. About to Dallas, to my hometown to get fixed. Because in the country, it's a little bit cheaper, you know, than the city. So if I can make it down here to get my stuff fixed, shit, I'm getting, I'm coming. But man, my mom said, all the way down there. Nice little walk, man. But nigga, it's hot. It's hot, so now I gotta go pick up my other car. Uh, I also gotta get some videos of the box Chevy, cause somebody said they wanna buy the box Chevy, so I'll probably record a little bit on this video and add it in this video. But I'm about to get out this phone and walk to my tea lady crib. So I just made it to the crib. I know y'all see me in different clothes, man, cause I just left the gym. As y'all can see, man, these games is on its way back. You feel me? Um, I am 10 pounds down with like 15 more pounds to lose. So the boy's staying focused right now in this gym. Um, but anyway, uh, the guy called me and told me that uh, my truck, uh, he found a problem. It was a hose that was like touching my, uh, touching something underneath the motor and it, it got hot and it burned the hole in it. So it's just a simple fix. Thank God, bro. I did not want to spend a couple thousand dollars right now getting that AC fixed. But, so, uh, we getting that done, we getting that fixed, and uh, I'm also got to head back to my hometown to pick up my car because that is fixed also. So, uh, it is June, June the 2nd, I believe. Man, we got six months left for this year, bro. Six months. So, man, time is not waiting. So, um, take take it serious bro like stop playing man get yourself together bro like shit moving like that but at the end of the day uh just continue to stay focused continue to stay blessed and man continue to put god first you know what i'm saying i don't see a lot of people say put god first on youtube man just you got to put him first go around him with nothing but uh once again uh appreciate y'all for watching the video make sure y'all subscribe to my youtube channel man uh let's get it your boy out peace